Hi everyone, I'm back with another ASOS haul. This one is just a few little things. Welcome to my bedroom. This is probably a very uninspiring background, but um, hello, all the same. It's not seasonal or anything like that. It's just some things that I thought were nice, so I got them. Uh, I think most of them are on sale, which is always good. And I will try the items on and link them down below in the description, so if you want to go and check them out you can and if they're gone I'll try and link something similar. So yeah, hope you enjoy this haul. Let's get stuck in. Oh yeah, I remember this. This is a one of those grey jumpers with frills on. I've really liked them but I haven't seen one that I was particularly fond of until I saw this one on ASOS. So I thought I'd get it, try it out. It has frills on the shoulder. It's a bit, I feel like this trend has kind of already gone. <laughs> I've been and gone but I'd like to try it anyway. Oh yeah, so it goes, the frill grows across the front as well, and across the back, and over the shoulders. It's quite big. It looks a bit big for me, but I shall try it on and see what happens. I feel like a bit of a failed clown in this, or some kind of over-the-top puffy jellyfish. Perhaps a cross between a puffer fish and a jellyfish, like, it's too big and it's too much. Yeah, I don't think I'll be keeping this. The next thing I got was from New Look on ASOS, and I've already started using this to be honest. But it's like a black camera bag with kind of a gold metallic top bit. It's a really good size, that is pretty big, you can fit a pretty big camera in there. The zips are pretty solid, and there's a bit of material in between, so these is this. So these is are, these are two sections here. So you can put your camera in one side and your like chargey stuff in the other. It was only seven pounds and I like it. I like it a lot. It's got this kind of textured matte black, like a kind of fake textured leather. Um, and I think it works really well with the metallic. Is that kind of rose gold or is that just like pale gold? Is that copper? I think it's like a pale gold metallic. Stripe in the middle. Uh, the strap's adjustable and removable. It's got the two cookie things on either end. It's a really good bag. I needed the camera bag because my old one broke. Like the zip just came off and it was really cheap to begin with. So yeah, I really like this. It feels like sturdy. I've been carrying it around with me for two weeks. <laughs> I took it on holiday with me. So I can confirm that it's pretty hard wearing, pretty solid. You know, no problems with it. It's really, it's really good. It's really hard wearing. And I like it a lot. My camera likes it too. The other thing I got was this shirt from Jack Wills. The only thing I have from Jack Wills is some Christmassy pyjama bottoms, which I love. And I've had them for years, <laughs> and they're still going strong. I uh, bring them out over Christmas. Don't have your Christmas pyjamas. I just really like this shirt. I thought it was quite feminine, but not too much. I like the sleeves, they're not too big. You know, the normal kind of shirt sleeves are quite thick, but these are sort of thin and they've got a button on them. It's got a double ruffle. <laughs> but it's not, I don't think it's too much. And I think that'll be really good for work. And it's white and then it's got sort of, are they grey or blue? I'm gonna go with black pinstripes, like horizontal pinstripes. And I thought this was really nice. It's hella see-through, but I like it. It's got potential. It's really cute. I guess you've just got to wear like a white or a plain bra with it, or just wear a white vest top underneath, which I'm happy to do. You can see my tattoo. <laughs> I really like it though. I think it's really, really proper, really cute. It's very um, English and it fits really nicely. Plenty of movement. You know shirts when you can't do that? They're the worst. <laughs> I was really excited to get this because I loved it on the model, but, you know the models on ASOS, when they're not plus size, they're like a size 8. So they're all quite small. <laughs> and I'm not plus size, but I'm not a size 8, that's for sure. I don't know. I don't know if it looks good. I don't know if it's going to like be a bit much. And I always think these kind of things probably look better on people who have 
less boobage. I like how big it is. I like how like drapey and casual it's gonna be. I love stripes. And I love all the t-shirts that ASOS are doing that are like different stripey t-shirts sort of cut together. I think they're cool. So this is kind of like that. When I got it, I thought, oh, it's quite thick. It's almost like a jersey material. It's quite, it's almost like a jumper. It's such a thick t-shirt. This is gonna be quite a warm t-shirt, like not something you wanna wear on a hot summer's day, I would say. But um, like you could use it as a jumper, I guess, or as something in between a t-shirt and something, and a jumper, sort of something in between that. Like a warm autumn day, <laughs> or a really hot winter day, or a cold summer day. You know what I mean, maybe it's good for spring. <laughs> so I'm not sure about that one, for me. I really like it, I wanted to love it. Oh, I don't know. I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep this. I kind of like it, but I'm not sure if it kind of works. I do like it though. It'll come in handy for when I want to pretend to be an escaped convict or something. <laughs> Cause they always have stripes. I sort of like it in principle, but there's something not quite right about it. I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep it. I'm not sure. Close up it looks good from like here, but then if I step back a bit, now it just looks like too big. There's no, there's no shape to it. I guess that's kind of the point of it, but it's also the problem. I don't know, let me know what you think. So the next thing I got was this t-shirt from Cheap Monday. And it's just got their logo on. It says Cheap Monday Stockholm. And it's got the, um, zigzag, this word, lightning bolt type logo on it, um, which I've seen on some of the other stuff. I really like their skull logo. I think that would look cool like if it was on the back. I kind of want to get a skull, a cheap Monday skull t-shirt, but one day. So it's got really long arm, really long arm humps these thingies. So you get a bit of like underarm in there, which I like. I really like the kind of dropped sleeve holes. <laughs> and on the, in the picture, I wasn't sure if it was going to be like too short. It looks slightly cropped and it has been cut and it's kind of rolling up, you know, like how cropped, deep, well, if you cut some cotton it does like kind of roll up. So, I'm hoping it won't be too cropped. I don't really want to get my belly up. I do like it. I like the design and the shape and the bold logo. Overall I like it, but we shall see. I like it but it is a bit short. I'm kind of thinking I might just try and remember to um, wear like a vest top underneath or something because it's slightly too short or I can definitely wear it with like high waisted trousers. I really like it. I think I'm going to keep it because I love the logo. But yeah, I do wish it was slightly longer. I also got this t-shirt which I've been wearing a lot because I took it on holiday. So please excuse the creases. So this is a t-shirt and it says making magic happen in like grey. Almost joined up handwriting but not all of it's joined up which is weird. But anyway, yeah, I really like this. I got it in what I thought was quite a big size for me but um, I've been wearing it and actually it fits really well. So maybe size up if you get this. If you're between sizes go for the bigger one. Maybe. Unless you want it uber tight. Because I, when I saw this I thought oh that's kind of cool. It kind of reminds me of like witches <laughs> making magic happen but then i was wearing it the other day and i thought what if people think that i'm referring to my boobs which are making the magic happen and that made me slightly embarrassed <laughs> because boobs are pretty magic let's be fair and when they're actually doing their boob job of making milk for babies they're also magic then because i saw this thing on facebook where this woman had like for some reason put her boob milk in two plastic bags and one of them was kind of creamy pale and one of them was sort of slightly yellow and the yellow one was for like when her baby was ill her body started like the milk naturally became more yellow because it had more antibodies in it to like cure her baby which is insane <laughs> boobs are magic i didn't know they could do that i didn't know your body would like adjust how does it know <laughs> it's kind of amazing but yeah i hope nobody thinks that i i wanted it to mean that in like a witchy way i didn't really 
I remember my friend had a t-shirt that said, mind the gap. Um, and it was like a reference to London Underground, but obviously slogans are always here. So, um, <laughs> I was like, are they making a reference to you? <laughs> anyway, yes, I love this t-shirt, it fits really well, and I will continue to wear it lots. Okay, the last and final thing is, I love it, it's a body, which is black, and it's got this, it's got a sweetheart, what do you call that a sweetheart neckline? It's like a kind of heart shape, lace sleeves, and choker neck, and it's from Parisian, Parisian? I love it so much, it's got really nice, I just really like the lace, I think that's pretty sexy. It's got like poppers on the bottom, and then a zip, ooh, come on zippy, ooh, quite a stiff zip. Um, a zip on the back, and then you kind of wiggle in. Oh, and on the boob it has like a kind of uh, grippy, grippy like rubber thing to hold it in place. So you don't have any slips wardrobe malfunctions. I love it. I think it's so sexy. I want to wear this on a date night. Late night date night. I love it. I love it. I love it. I'm really glad I got it. So that was my ASOS haul, I hope you enjoyed, it was just a few little things, sorry it's so small and kind of random, but I hope you enjoyed anyway, I hope you're having a great day and I'll see you in the next video, bye!